Hey folks, Dog Day Scam Adventures is here. Please like, subscribe, share. Um, this was a 30 something minute phone call. It's the Medicare and I completely annoyed the crap out of them as much as I could. I'm going to try and edit it around so you guys can get some laughs. I'm not an editor. I never played one on TV either, <laughs> but I'll do it the best I can. It's kind of long, but I'm kind of trying to make it to cut it up as best as I could. Okay, here we go. Cherry, hold on, I'll go get her, hold on. Cherry, okay, phone. Waiting. Hold on a minute. Cherry, Cherry, got a phone call there. Yeah. Ah. I'm coming. Hello, this is Cherry. Cherry, by the way, do you remember I already had a conversation for your diabetic Peter? So Did I know Peter? Who, Peter who? I don't know, I don't remember Peter. Who's Peter? I am, I called you for the diabetic meter just about a few days ago for your sex. I, I don't remember any. Like a meter maid. Like you're going to meet somebody, but you're saying a meter. Right? A diabetic monitor, yes. Meter. A monitor. You know, the monitor. The monitor. I, oh, yeah. I understand now. Yes. Yes. And so you are the diabetic, right? Am I a diabetic? Yes, of course I am, yes. How many times you check the blood sugar? Ah, about twice a day they got me checking it. Okay, the cherry. Yeah? Hold on. I have the lady on the line. The lady, she will wait to send you the meter to your dirty step, okay? I got a lady on the line, okay. I am connecting you with my lady, okay? One minute, she's with you in a second. Hold on. Big. And I believe you have your Medicare card with you, right? Got a Medicare card with me, a card. Yeah, I got the Medicare card. Yeah, I got that, yeah. So, Teddy, this is very important. Can you go and grab your red, white, and blue card? Go grab the red, white, and blue card. Are you sure it's not, it's it's red, white, and blue, or is it white, blue, and red? It's a red, white, and blue. It's not a problem. I'm waiting. Go grab the card, okay? I gotta go grab a card. Okay, hold on. I'll go get it. Hold on. Waiting. Hold on. Number and... Hold on, I don't remember what I did with it now. Hold on. Okay, I'm waiting. Yeah. The card? Cherry Celsius, my name. No, no, no. The name of the card. Card name. What is the card name? Cherry Celsius. No, what is the insurance name? What is the insurance name? Medicare. Great. So please hold on, this is the last call I have my lady, okay? Hold with her, she will send you. Okay. Hold on. Okay. Hello? Yes? Yes, hi, uh, good afternoon. Am I speaking to Cherry Seltzer? Yes. Okay, Miss Cherry, correct me if I'm wrong. Is this uh, your date of birth? January... Uh, one, 1950. That's right. That's my date of birth. You got me. Cherry Salsa. It's my pleasure having the line, ma'am. You do have a very nice uh, date of birth, ma'am. Yeah. You're a baby, uh, new, new Year baby. Yeah. <laughs> okay. And ma'am, uh, mind me asking, um, uh, are you uh, a diabetic? Yeah. Okay, and um, are you a type 1 or a type 2 diabetic? I'm a 2. And how many times that you're checking your blood sugar? Nah, I'm supposed to check it three times. I check it twice, sometimes once. It's a pain in the ass checking it. Okay, so usually how many times a day, man? What? Usually 
How many times a day that you are checking your blood sugar? Yeah, twice, usually twice. I try for twice. Okay, and how about injecting insulin? Yeah, I do that. I gotta do that too, yeah. When I remember. <laughs> yeah. Okay, what do you mean, uh, uh, ma'am? Um, are you injecting insulin or you're not injecting insulin? Yeah, I gotta inject it. Yeah, I inject it. Okay, and how many times a day that you're injecting insulin? Uh, that twice a day I gotta do that. That's right. Lucky me. Huh. Yeah. What I mean is, in the household? Yeah. Okay. And do you have a Medicare Part B, red, white, and blue? I got that. Yeah, I got it. I got the uh, the, the, the card, the, the, the red, white, and blue card. I got it. Yeah, I got it. Okay. Yeah. And how about the Medicare Advantage plan? Or a private insurance plan? No, I don't have that. I wanted to get one, but, it, you know, it's like when pigs fly. I, it was too much money, so I couldn't do it. And it, it I got it, I got that, but everything but the kitchen sink I got, you know? I don't have that one, no. All right, do you have your insurance uh, with you right now? I have the insurance card, yeah. I just, uh, I got to put a, put, put a, a, a sack in it, and I got it in the back. Okay, and you also get your insurance uh, insurance cards? Yeah, I got the card. Yeah, like I, I think I got this from my husband from all the aggravation he gave me. He used to he used to drink like a fish, you know. He was he was crazy, and then, and he would always make this crazy food. And, and, and well, some of it was finger licking good, but uh, I think he's the one who gave it to me. You know, I think it was him with all the, the junk he made me eat and everything over the years. You know, but I'm sitting on the fence if it was him or not. I don't know. But I think that's how I got the diabetes thing, yeah. Love giving I, him, I think that's how I got it. Love giving them the idioms. Yeah. Love the idioms. Hello? Yeah, so, uh, what I'm asking, yeah. uh, what I'm asking is that do you, do, you have, uh, do you have it with you right now? The, and, I, yeah, I got the card. I just got the man asked me for the card, and I told him I got the card. You know, you got to hold your horses and I'll get it out. <laughs> hold on. What do you want me to do with the card? I get, you want me to read you the card? Hello? On, I'll be asking for the... What? Later on, I'll be asking for the uh, insurance details of your insurance card. Oh, okay, I got to get all my ducks in a row here. Okay, yeah, I got the card. I, the man said get the card and I got the card. I'm an eager beaver. <laughs> All right. And now, uh, what is the uh, name the, uh, of the insurance uh, that you have right now, ma'am? Medicare. Medicare. And aside from Medicare, do you have other insurance? No, I got nothing. I'm an eager beaver to get something else, though, I'll tell you that. But they got me running around like a headless chicken <laughs> trying to get this other one, you know? It's a lot of money. I don't, I don't have it. Okay. Yeah. All right. And Ms. Terry, um, the, the spelling of your last name is uh, S-E-L-E-Z-E-R. Yeah, yeah, that's right. It's a crazy name. A lot of people think it's like a monkey business with my name. But, uh, you know, I do the best I can with the name I got. What am I going to do? It's a crazy name. <laughs> a lot of people think it's a cock and bull story, but it's not. Yeah. Okay, do you have do you have an email address? No, I don't do that. I don't do that. I'd be like a bull in a china shop with an email address. I I would just you know, I'd knock everything over and I'd forget numbers and everything else. So it wouldn't work out for me. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Uh ma'am, in case that we get disconnected, I have your phone number here. Yeah. Six oh seven seven four eight. Like a piece of Swiss cheese. I I forget things. That's why I would never have an email account. Why would I, I? I can't remember how to do it, you know? Okay, I understand. And Mr. Henry, do you have other number that we can read? No, no. You know, no, I wish I did have an, uh, an email account. They, they say it's like the best thing since sliced bread. But I just don't have that. <laughs> if I had an email account, it'd be like I'm holding a hot potato. <laughs> 
Yeah, that's not good. I can't do it. I tried and I just didn't understand. So now I'm just what you call a couch potato. <laughs> I wouldn't even try to do it. <laughs> okay. It makes me go bananas if I have it. Yeah. Okay, and ma'am, uh, aside from being a diabetic, are you also using a CPAP or a BiPAP machine? No, I don't have that. I don't. I, I, you know, I had a bone to pick with my doctor on that one. He, he wanted me to use that thing for the sleeping thing. You know what I did instead? I couldn't sleep. You know what I did? I took his advice with a grain of salt. I went out and I bought a nice bottle of gin. And every night I have a nice tall glass of that on ice, and I go right to sleep. <laughs> That's it. Now I got no problem, and I don't need that machine either. You know? Okay. That's a good idea. Yeah. yeah. And, and uh, Mr. Ria, do you have uh, a middle name or a middle name? No, I don't have a middle name. My mother, that's another thing. My mother, she, she didn't even have the decency to give me a middle name. <laughs> I got everything else but the kitchen sink, but no middle name. I think when I was born, she got up on the wrong side of the bed. <laughs> I don't know why I didn't get a, a, a middle name. It's like a wet blanket over my head. I don't know why. Oh. I think she was mad at my, my, my daddy, and she was trying to pull the wool over his eyes. <laughs> I don't understand it. And Mr. Terry, uh, what is your preferred language? My language? My language? What? The English. That's all I can speak. If I don't even speak it that good, I, I do it by the skin of your teeth. I'm just managing that. And I've been doing it for 73 years. I'm still trying to learn my own language. It's terrible. Terrible. Bad accent and everything else. When you, when you come in my neck of the woods and you know, I'll be, oh, you can understand me okay, you know? It's just... uh. We run neck and neck together and you'll get me. <laughs> yeah. When I go to other places, I go belly up because uh, they, they just don't understand. Sitting next to me, you know, it's crazy. And I don't understand it either. What are you going to do? I do the best I can. That's it. And Mr. Reed, my man, uh, can, can I have your uh, shipping address, please? Can I have what? Your shipping address. Oh, 147 Main Street in Johnson City, New York. Yeah, 13790 is my address. <laughs> and you're dust. You know, they're, they're dead. That's just me now. And it's better. I'm better off. You know? To be honest with you, I was bur bursting at the seams to be alone, and now I'm alone, so it's great. No. Okay, what is the apartment number? No, nah, just one. Apartment 1. Yeah. Okay, thank you. Okay. Hey, Mr. V, uh, just to confirm, um, is the card that you use to your doctor a red, white, and blue Medicare card? What? Um, is the card that you use to your doctor a red, white, and blue Medicare card? Yeah, that, that's the one. I think a fat chance I'd give him any other card. That's the one I gave him. Okay, thank you. And ma'am, before we continue and for security of your account, I will also need the last four of your social. I know, I, I gotta go look it up. Um, uh, 70, 6709. 6709, I think it is. Uh, can you please uh, double check, ma'am? Only just the last four. Okay, can, you know? Like, uh, Take your time. Uh, I, I gotta break the ice with my brain. I gotta go look. Okay, hold on. Let me go get the number. Oh, God. Hold on. Let me look over here. The nine zero. Six, seven, nine, zero. Yes. Right? Yes. Yes. Uh, okay. And can I, uh, I got that one by the skin of my teeth. I happen to have the card in the drawer. And, and sometimes I can't find anything. And I, I cut corners, but I found it. I found it. Okay, can I have the member ID number of your Medicare, please? The Medicare card. Now you want me to go get that card. All right, the ball's in your court. All right, hold on. Let me go get that card now. 
You told me you needed the other card. Huh? Hello? Uh, just only the medic here, ma'am. Yeah, hold on. Yeah. What do you need? Okay, ma'am. Better late than never, but I do got it, yeah. yeah. What? What? The member ID number, ma'am. Member ID number. Yeah. One. E like, um, yum, 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 Edward. G like, uh, the George. I think there was King of England, Edward and George, if I remember. Yeah, number four. T like, terminal. Uh, E like, Eddie again. Number five. Then, uh, M like, murder. K like, uh, kindness. Seventy-two. Okay, thank you. And aside from this insurance, do you have other insurance, ma'am? Nothing. I, I, I bit the bullet on the insurance. I was on the fence trying to get, uh, you know, another one, and I uh, never got it. It's too much money, you know. Uh, what, you know, you win some, you lose some. You know, what am I, I wanted to beat around the bush to get another insurance, but I never did. They didn't cut me any slack to give me a cheap insurance either. Huh. Okay, so ma'am, can, uh, can you please double check your member ID number? Because there's uh, something, a uh, um, uh, problem with your uh, insu uh, member ID number, ma'am. Can you please repeat it to me slowly, please? Oh my God, let's not cry over spilt milk. All right, hold on. Let me get my head out of the clouds. I'll look at it again. Uh, would be the letter E. Like, um, oh, I don't know, everything. Everything, like the letter E, E V E R, you know, N Y T I N G, everything, yeah. Uh, then after that is the, is the letter G, like for God. You know, I don't have to explain that one, G O D, God. Uh, then the number four, F O U R. Then there's a dash, maybe I guess what I did wrong. There's a dash. Uh, 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 dash. Did you get the dash? Yes. Uh, 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 then Rx GRP and the Rx uh, member on your card. Wow. What? I, I don't need to cut corners on this, but you got to give me some slack. What, what was the question? Do you see the um, word Rx bin? RxPCN, no, RxGRP, no. Rx member on your card. The Rx information, man. No, I don't see that. Didn't I just give you the number, though? <laughs> uh, that is the member, right? So you don't see this uh, um, Rx information on your card. Well, hold, let me look a little harder. Hold on a minute, all right? Hold on. Okay. Let me look. What am I looking for? An RX number? Yes, ma'am. RX bin, RX PCN, RX GRP, and RX member. Uh, what insurance do you have right now, ma'am? Medicare health insurance. Okay, that is the only insurance that you have. Yes. I provide you the supplies that you are interested in. Let's move on on to collecting your doctor's information, okay? Okay. So, Mr. Terry, all right, mind me asking, Mr. Terry, do you feel a chronic pain? Yes. And how about um, joint inflammation? Yeah. <laughs> Let me tell you something. I got I got m more bones broken to me than there are in a cemetery. Everything hurts. I'm always breaking a leg. I'm trying to cut corners to, to get ahead, but I'm always in pain. You know, it's it's a lot. It's a lot of pain I'm in, yes. Okay, and how about migraine or tension head? Yeah, I'll take that too. I'll take that. I got One day I'm going to bite the bullet, but so far I'm okay. Yeah. All right, I'll make another thing. Huh? Just give me uh, one more minute. Yeah. A dime a dozen the pain I got. Huh? Can I ask for your um, primary care doctor, please? I don't understand the question. You got to cut me some slack. I'm starting up to like, to, you're getting confused. What was the question? 
Uh, can I ask for your primary care doctor, please? My doctor. Let me think of his name. Doctor. 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 Primary care doctor. My doctor. So many doctors. And do- um, I'm trying to think. Oh, I can look into my book. You want to look for a minute? Oh, come, let me let me get my book out. Hold on. Can you hold on? No, sure, sure. Just take your time, man. I have, I have it. It's it, it, last name. Hello. Yes, ma'am. Yeah, the last name is Barr. B A R. I don't. I think it's an E or a, or we just B A R. And what is the first name, man? Ken. K E N. And he's got a middle initial of D. Middle initial D. Okay. Yeah. Ken. K E N D. Last name Bar. I'm sorry. His first name is Ken, K-E-N. His, his middle name or middle initial is D. And his last name is Ba. Okay. Um, can I have the phone number of this doctor, man? Oh, I gotta look that up. Hold on a minute. Give me that. I didn't write this down. Hold on, let me get that. It's at 315. Hello? Yes, ma'am. Yeah, 315. Did you get that? Yes, ma'am. Yeah, 76536. Ken, with middle initial D, last name Bar. Okay, and uh, what, is the, uh, na- uh, what is the name of the clinic? It's Central New York Psychiatric Center. Um... Ma'am, uh, I don't see uh, a name of uh, Ken um, Candy Bar. You don't see a Candy Bar. Uh, well, I can give you their address. I, 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 and I don't know if he's new or how long he's been there. I, like I said, I, I have problems, but I'll give you the address. You need the address. Um, the name of your doctor is written on your um, of on your medication, ma'am. Yeah, 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 they, they locked the medication on me so I don't uh, take too much. I'm a little embarrassed to tell you. That's why I drink yes. the gin at night. Yes, ma'am. Uh, I didn't ask God for that. I'm only asking uh, or uh, letting you know but the name of your doctor is written on your empty bottle of your medication. Yeah, they locked the medications up on me. They don't let me get to the medications. That's why I drink the gin at night. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, you need the address for the for the place. I'll give you the address if you need it. Okay. So what is the address, ma'am? It's nine zero zero five book M A C Y Marcy M A C Y New York, and the zip code is one three four zero three. Doctor Ken D Bar. Yes. Uh, can you please uh, double check the name of your doctor, ma'am? Yeah, I know it's. I know it's. Uh, huh? Can you please double check the name of your doctor because I don't see. Well, in my book it says. Uh, in my book it says I might have wrote it down. I might have put a C. It might be a K or a C. Can't like Dr. Candy Bar. That's what I got. Candy Bar. I don't know if it's a K or a C. I I don't know how he spells his name. Okay, well, what I would like for you to, uh, to check, ma'am, if you can check your medication, ma'am, were you able to have an idea what is the exact name of your doctor? No, they, they, they lock up my medication. They won't give me the, the medication. They keep it under lock because I get a take too much, they told me. That's why they put me in the psychiatric center. Uh, you're on the uh, psychiatric center right now. You're in the hospice care. No, no, I, they let me out. Well, let's put it this way. <laughs> they kind of didn't let me out. I kind of just like moseyed on out the road, you know, and uh, I did the best I could with the uh, the uniform and everything. And I've been home. And uh, they don't know I'm here yet. <laughs> they don't know where I am. <laughs> 
they got to kind of look for me. <laughs> you won't tell them, will you? I'm not going to tell them, uh, of course. All right. I'm just that um, because uh, the process that we have here, ma'am, is that we are going to send a prescription to your doctor regarding the diabetic supplies. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, I, uh, Dr. Candy Barr in the in this Central New York Psychiatric Center. That's that's where I, let's say I, uh, let's not use the word escape. It's a bit, took a vacation from. I, I, I took a, a leave. I went on a leave. Yeah, get tired of that place. Yeah. Okay, I'll be needing the uh, uh, exact name of your doctor, man. Yeah, Can, Candy Barr. Candy Barr is his name. Dr. Candy Barr. Every time they gave me the medicine, every time they gave me the medicine, they said, take your candy bar, and I took the medicine. Dr. Candy Bar. Can you check your insurance card, man? Um, it also written there the name of your PCP, your primary care physician. Yeah, it's uh, uh, Dr. Candy Bar. Yeah. Is that the exact... Um, the exact name, man, because I don't see any names uh, working on this uh, uh, psychiatric uh, clinic, man. You know, and, uh, well, uh, all right, uh, there, was a, there was another doctor I saw who was a, a lady doctor. Her first name was Crystal. You know how to spell Crystal, or shall I spell that? Hello? Crystal, C-R-Y-S-T-A-L. Yes, and her last name was Ball. B-A-L-L. Crystal Ball. Dr. Crystal Ball. She was very good at uh, diagnosing you in the future. Oh, so, uh, also diagnosing the uh, future? Yes. Crystal Ball. Dr. Crystal Ball. <laughs> <laughs> I can't keep going on with these crazy names. Are you done with me now? I'm not uh, yet done, ma'am. You're not done, okay. Thank you, sir. We had Crystal Ball, Dr. Crystal Ball, and then we had uh, Dr. Candy Bar. Uh, what else you want? Okay. I'm just making sure if you're serious about this one because you're giving me um, uh, a funny name so I'm your doctor. Are you laughing? No, I'm not, ma'am. Why not? We are working as a, pro we are working as a professional here and uh, we are um, the uh, uh, medical approved providers for home delivery of this uh, supplies, ma'am. Yeah. Okay? Yeah. And just that there's a reason why I'm just uh, asking you clearly and professionally yeah. the name of your doctor. And if you're going to give me such a funny names of your doctor, uh, probably I can end up this call then. Thank you so much for your time. And you do have a wonderful day. Okay, you sure you want more and more funny names? I can make up more. Huh? Bye-bye. Bye. -bye. Bye. <laughs> Thanks for the fun. <laughs> <laughs> Another happy customer. All right, guys. Sorry it was so long. It was just, uh, and I had to actually edit it. All right, guys. Stay safe and stop the scam.